morning, my name is Jim McLaren. Today is Tuesday, October the 23rd, 2018. Today we're going to look at my wake and wave. We're going to take this transformer apart. And uh, I've had it unplugged for a couple of the two, three days now. But you still got to check your capacitor. You got to discharge it. Make sure you have well insulated pliers or an insulated screwdriver. And you're just going to go across these terminals here and make sure that there's no power in here. Discharge it. Now this transformer is held on by four screws, in my case are Phillips screws that are located underneath your microwave. Now I already checked the, uh, the voltage here, you should get 120 volts across here, and there's this switch, well, the red goes to one switch, micro switch, the brown goes to another micro switch, and this white wire goes to this relay on your panel, and that gives you 120 volts across here. And I'll post a video on that and uh, showing you my multimeter. So I'm getting 120 volts across here. So now the next step is to check this. Now, to remove the this transformer, you're going to have to remove wires. And it's a good idea to make yourself a diagram with all the wires. I can remove all these wires today. And the magnetron wire has to come off. So let's start removing wires here. There's a couple on the capacitor here. I already discharged the capacitor, so. And then these wires, I'll just pull them off here. And the magnetron, it just simply comes off. And you can pull this wire off too. If you want. It's hard to do with one hand. It's coming off here. There you go. So now that all the wires are removed, and the last step is to take the four screws underneath the microwave that's holding it on. I'd like to thank all my subscribers, all my new subscribers. And if you watch this for the first time today, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for taking the time to listen to my video today. Have a great day.